always wanted to learn karate. Can we go check it out? I've always wanted to do it. Um, sure. I guess we can check it out. Hi, my name is Malena. Um, this looks like fun. What do we do here? I don't know. Today's my first day. My parents just signed me up. Yummy! <laughs> <laughs> what is he saying? I don't know. Maybe he wants us to do what he does. Guy name, take your cool show down. Take a shoe down? What is he talking about? Guy name, take your cool show down. Take a show down? I think he's crazy. Yeah, I have no idea what he's talking about. And remember your key eyes, us? Key eye? Yes, key eye. Hey! Why is he shouting for no reason? Hey, Milena, how's it going? Do you like it? No, I don't understand what they're doing. When I think of karate, I think we'd be doing stuff that I see on TV. I imagine we'd be jumping in the air, doing karate chops and breaking boards and cool stuff like that, but this is just weird. Well, actually, that reminds me of our scripture passage for today. Paul was concerned because Christians in a church were speaking in a special way so that most people wouldn't understand what they were saying. He even says that if a new person came into the church, they would think the people talking were crazy because it would seem so weird. Paul wanted to make sure that everyone understood what they were saying and doing so that everyone could grow in their faith and love. And maybe that would help us here too. Let me see what I can do. Excuse me, sir. Yes? These two new students here don't understand what you're saying or doing. Do you think you could take a moment to help explain things to them? Yes, thank you for the suggestion. Sometimes I forget that not everyone knows what we do here. Yeah, what was the first thing you said? You may or yummy? Close. Yummy. It's what you do and I want you to stop. This is the action you do for yummy. What about those other things you said? Well, a kata is a series of moves that you do to help learn your technique. And the kia is a special shout. Thanks, this is starting to make a lot more sense now. And I think that it's a good reminder for us in the church too. There's a lot of things that we still do in churches that won't make sense to a lot of people, or they might even think is weird and crazy. We need to make sure that everyone understands what we're doing in church so that they can grow in their faith. And the things that were strange will make sense to us too. Exactly, let's try this again, and this time I'll make sure you understand. So first put your feet out like this, and your hand out like this, and your other hand like this. And then just do this without moving your feet. Good. Yeah, me? And I hope that helps you understand our scripture passage just a little bit better. Goodbye! Goodbye.